Hey everyone, Hunter here, or Forever Lego Studios. Welcome back to another review. I am joined with, again, the Banana Man. You. Aiden, stop forcing the burp. Aiden. There we go. <laughs> Good gosh. Aiden. I ask him to do videos with me, and he burps. Then there's Drake playing a video game, and... He's playing Brayden Destiny. On the bed. Brayden is still Sleep. sleeping. Well, yeah, we Third video with Brayden still sleeping. Yeah, we just we just got done recording the... About, uh, about, 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 about two hours ago. No, it wasn't two hours ago. About an hour and a half. About an hour and 30 minutes. Yeah, around that time. Yeah. So we're going to record this video, and then we're going to head to bed. Yeah, because it's like, like almost two o'clock. No, I think it's almost one. A little after one. What time is it? It's one thirty nine. Wow. Yeah. So we're gonna make this video real quick and then head to bed, cause we got a busy day tomorrow. We're going laser tagging. Yep. Maybe maybe come books comics and things. Yeah. We're gonna go back to a comic book store. But today's ba uh, uh, review we have the Bounty Hunter Speeder Bike Battle Pack. They have uh, these battle packs have a lot. Why are you showing crusty? Cause again. That's weird. But uh, these battle packs have long names. Um, the original Obi Wan Kenobi. The <laughs> me. Uh, ages six to twelve. Number seven five one six seven. Has one hundred twenty five pieces and retails again for fifteen dollars. Like new building packs. toy jetty construction. To to get that to pair a construction toy. Do what? I don't know. I'm trying to read that. I can't know what this says. Building. Oh. Jetty para construction. Surprisingly, there are actually more pieces in this than this. Well, you, I, I can I can see why. Because so. of this and that. True. I don't Plus, there's IG-88. I don't know why um, I said that because of this and that. It's one whole okay. thing. First, right, so this is the Bounty Hunter Battle Pack. This is the one that everyone's been wanting to get. I, don't, I've not, I haven't been wanting to get it. You haven't? No. You should get it. Not everyone, want, not everyone wants to get it because I don't. But uh, some Star Wars fans want to get it. Brayden, I got that for him for his birthday. I just bought this yesterday. Yeah, uh, the, only, I it Monday. the only reason I always wanted to get it because it has my my, my 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 two favorite bounty hunters. Bosk and Bosk and him. Oh, but I wish I wish I had Boba Fett. Yeah, well you can. Uh, that one at Target had. Uh, These Boba are my Fett. least two favorite because this one looks like a weird and and this this guy looks like a bug. But yeah, this was uh, full on. Okay, first we're gonna show is Bosk. Uh, probably my favorite out of the set, other than Dengar. Yeah. Uh, or Forlong. Um, we have Bosk. This is the newest version of him. We haven't, uh, the last time we got him was in that Superstar Destroyer, and that was years ago, and that one was okay. Um, but the only reason you would want to get the Superstar Destroyer, other than the build, was, uh, the collectible, uh, bleh, collectible figures. Um, and here's what Bosk looks. He looks really cool. He's got new, uh, well, it's the same, G uh, Head, just different printing. Printing on his awesome. feet. You can see his toes. Printing on his legs. Uh, thigh. It, or not thigh. Uh, waist. Waist. Body. Here's the body he looks like on if, the back. If, if you've ever played Battlefront, this is my, my most favorite character in that game because I've gotten like 200 kills in the game. This is like a Battlefront battle pack, pretty much. Yeah. Other than Forlorn because you can't play. Or. For Alam and IG-8, you can't play them yet. So this is Bosk, probably my favorite. He's got the stud shooter. Everyone's seen it. So next we have Bosk. What? I'm a goofy gooper, yeah. Oh. You're a goofy gooper, yeah. Yeah, we did that goofy gooper goofy video. Goofy gooper, yeah. Goofy goofy gooper, gooper, yeah. Yeah, we did. That Hope song is stuck in my head. Yeah, we started singing that for a video. Uh, next we have Dengar. Uh, probably my favorite bounty hunter next to He's Boba really Fett. He's really OP. He is a cool bounty hunter. Like, Boba Fett's my favorite, but Dengar's going to have to be my next. Boba Fett's, uh, Boba Fett and Boss are really OP in Battlefront. If you know what OP means, it means overpowered. Yes. The sad thing is, is the exact same as the uh, um, the Freemaker Adventure set that came out last year. Doesn't surprise me that they put in... I wish he got like leg printing, but it's the same exact one. Uh, and that's that was thirty bucks. So technically, this is a cheaper way to get him. Um, but I don't know. I wish they updated him a little. Yeah, excuse me. Next, we have Forlom. He is exclusive in the set in this set alone, and has never been made before. 
So this is one bounty hunter, the bounty, uh, the uh, Star Wars, uh, the original Star Wars He's fans. Probably my least favorite bounty hunter. Um, have been wanting in Lego because uh, we never gotten it before. This is the first time we've ever gotten a uh, Z- uh Forlom. Now we're just waiting for Zuckus. Maybe they'll redo the uh, Super Star Destroyer. Um, sometime that'd be pretty cool, and to have a uh, all of them like with extra printing. So this is what he looks like. He looks like one of those droids, but he's got like rusting on or all over it. Uh, looks like a protocol droid. I don't know what that red slash is. Um, I don't know. Um, mm. I like the printing of this. It's kind of chromish. The whole body's kind of chromish. Zuckus and him look look really look really alike. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I just I just looked up what we look like and they look a lot alike. Yes. Yeah, they really do. Uh, they're, both, so, they're both bug people. So now all we're waiting for is Zuckus. Now yeah. we have Forlom, and he's exclusive in the set and is not in any other sets uh, right now. So if you definitely are a Bounty Hunter fan, definitely get the set. Just because, mainly because of him, but also the other figures. Uh, here is, the last one is IG-88. Um, as far as I can tell, he's new. He, he's... I, I don't know. He's Maybe. okay. He's just look. Hey, the only thing that's cool is this is a printed head. The rest is just assassin droids. He gets this sniper, the stud shooter. He's okay, we, but we we might have gotten him. In, we might have gotten him in a, in a early Lego set. We've got here. We have. We got him plenty. We got him. In, we even got him in a book. Uh, so he's literally the. Eh. He's probably my least favorite. The cool thing is I never got him. I yeah. don't have any of these figures, so it is cool. I don't know. He's just my least favorite. Here's probably the worst thing about the set is the speeder bike. I really don't like the design of it. Um, just because you can only fit one person on here, which kind of stinks. Yeah. Um, but the whole complete design is eh. Like, I've seen way better battle pack uh, speeders. I've seen, I've seen way worse speeders before. Now, I'm not saying it's bad, like, it's okay. Um, like, here, I'll take Bosk. can take his blaster off. Take Bosk. That's what he looks like. Really sitting in that. Doesn't it's have any handlebar. It's way too big. I just don't really care for the design. I might buy I pick up another one, give the figures to a friend, and just uh, use the pieces. Because there are a lot of useful parts in the set. I was very surprised. Doctor, is this look a little bit too big, actually? Kind of. It's got the stud shooters. It's got little blasters on each side right here, and they can move back. We've got this little engine backpack right here, a little windshield, this thing that flaps up and flaps down. These two other engines are guns. I don't see. That's what uh, one thing I don't understand. Like, are these guns? Are these engines? I, don't, I have no idea. Um, then you have these uh, little things, and plus, what's really cool is you get a lot of the blue, uh, light, light blue. Like, uh, the sand blue. Or, no, this isn't the sand blue. But this is the light, light blue. Sky blue? Sky blue, yeah. So, I like that. So, that's why I might buy this battle pack again. I might buy it and then give it. I give the figures to our friend. Or keep the figures and, like, use them for something else. But, I don't know. Um, the speeder bike's eh to me. The only reason... I'm not the only pe- uh, person who uh, has said this. Other people just want to get the actual figures in the set. I agree with them. Uh, but over er, overall, I really like the Lego set. Um, I do apologize for not uh, doing the whole uh, build on camera thing. I would usually do that, but I'm not home now. Again. It's, re- it's really late. Yes. Um, also, Aiden. Aiden finally figured out what he was going to say. It was sponsor. Yes. A really easy word to remember, and I forgot it. Yes. That was the word he was trying to figure out earlier. In the I, last I, ju- I, ju- I remember it like, a, like an hour ago. Okay, it's finally he figured out. So, hope you guys did enjoy the small little uh, review on the battle pack. I told you and I promised I would do a few battle, a uh, few reviews on some of the new sum, uh, summer sets um, as I got them. But, hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, uh, think about hitting that like button. As uh, If you're at all new to this channel, uh, definitely think about hitting subscribe uh, the subscribe button. We are getting new subscribers every day. Especially to juggle it. Yes. And, uh... I'm very uh, happy about that. 
But I'll see you guys in another video. Hope you guys have a great and wonderful day. Bye-bye.